go ahead and save again, because you know me, I'm liking the saving. Yard lock told me that I should be saving more, so that's that's what I do. I like to save. I like to save, save, save. Head out, bird. Yes! This actually feels like they kind of reused um some assets and whatnot. Maybe I should go this way. Oh yeah, this definitely is. Oh wow. Okay. It kind of helped to know where I should go or not, but oh well. I'll figure it out eventually. Whoa! <laughs> Glad to be here. Thanks for having me again. Oh, once again. <laughs> Why you gotta be like all polite about it? Like, I can imagine you like bound and everything like that. <laughs> like, oh, thank you <laughs> so much. Like, no, it's, it's my pleasure. So I'm always glad for people to be here. I believe we are safe now. Shall we adjourn here until the morrow? What makes you think we're safe? I cast a force field around the forest. Even were Walther to follow us by teleportation, he would be unable to reach us here. In that case, we should rest. I wouldn't mind resting. She's such a little thing. You surprised me. I thought Silmeria was still with us. She only comes out when we need her for object reading. Usually it's just me. <laughs> I'm sorry. I wish I could be of more help. I beg your forgiveness. I never intended to insinuate such a thing. As one versed in the arcane, I am merely intrigued by two spirits sharing one body. Sweet talk all you want. Silmeria can see right through it. So can object reading be used to read another's mind? Well, seems like it should be possible. Interesting. Shall we give it a try? What? It would be an honor, Lady Silmeria. If you have thoughts or feelings that are inseparably bound to another life. Or memories of someone who affected you deeply. Then, I can read those thoughts. Is that so? Allow me to abstain. I would rather not know about my other lives. Perhaps the gentleman would oblige. I'd like to believe that in all my other lives, I have been a defender of Dupan. Brown noser. If you mess around with your powers, won't that other Valkyrie detect us? You've got a point. You two must also be fatigued from your journey. A brief respite is in order. I shall wake you before the sun is high. Naturally, I shall keep watch as you rest. Don't you need sleep? <laughs> just going to sleep anyway. Alright, dude, whatever. What a oddly like like sober moment. Like legit. Seriously, what was with that? Okay, we're getting a little bit closer to where I remember I was going. I was around here somewhere that I I ended up stopping. I recall it being like a desert area. So yeah. Dude, look at this map. This is crazy. It's like a big old chessboard and everything. That is so cool. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Off to uh, the plains. Don't go to sleep, he'll kill you with a sand! With a sand attack! Because, <laughs> as we all know, Kara is out to get us. Oh, yeah, 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 we're definitely getting close to where I was essentially um, near the end. Monsters lurk beyond here. If you don't want to fight, you best avoid contact. Conflict. 
There are several ways to do this, but each monster type has its own trick. For instance, time a jump correctly to leap over monsters that crawl on the ground. The flying spirit type monsters close in by disappearing and reappearing, so look out. Can't jump over the ones with wings, so you'll need to stick uh, underneath them. Of course, the best thing to do is to stop them in the tracks. True, true, true. I don't recall, like, the game being particularly hard, so it's like, whatever. Oh, dude, I got both of them. No! I shall crush you. Ah, that's fine. I'm just gonna crush her. It's, where is... Warning Joel? Are, are you the... The Enemers? That I need to fight? Oh! <laughs> Congrats, everybody! It's everyone's favorite member of my crew. Uh, the... Tr the garbage truck <laughs> coming right on time my goodness gracious every Monday I swear I mean at the very least I can say that my trash is getting picked up proper oh break mode this is where things just get crazy that's right get out there <laughs> dude got annihilated so that was the that was the leader of the group well, I know him well. But he ain't Donkey Kong, I'll tell you that much. Get over here. So, yeah, I need to figure out whether or not if I'm able to actually dodge anything or whatever. It certainly doesn't seem like I can. I just have to, like, get lucky, kinda. There we go, leader down. Uh, head to finish it as as garbage uh, garbage truck Chan to to throw away edgy voice actors. I don't think Gar was that edgy. Like he was emo, like yeah, but like it's not the voice actor's fault. Oh jeez, get away from me! What is that thing? You need a short hop proper. Okay, nothing there. It's fine. What is with this pretty music? It's like pretty all day, every day. That's a nice thing. Don't kill the flying fish thing! I HAD TO KILL IT! Why do you- Why are you like thinking that like I don't want to kill things? It's quite a, quite the opposite. Frankly, they attack me first. Oh, uh, no! We'll, we'll attack the next one. Yeah, there we go. Oh god. Oh, I get to shoot three now! Yep, I can shoot three. Get out of here. This might take some time. Die off of my fist. <laughs> what? So I, I count that as edgy. Okay. I mean, that's fair. Uh, I don't think the leader's gonna die in one, in like one fell swoop. So. So we need to make sure to get rid of all the other ones. Yeah, it'd be better just to get rid of all of them first and foremost. Is it the gang up on me? It's that's that's bad. Oh, break mode. Uh, that's not talking about. Mash the buttons together. That's what you like to see. Okay. Cool. And one thing. Come on, get at me. Get at me, bro. Oh, I was almost at a hundred. I don't know what it does, but. Hey, almost at a hundred. A little more. More. There we go. Yeah, this is just a little bit. I just can't kill him right away, that's the problem. I don't know what I could do. Oh. No, thank you. What's that guy doing over there? I didn't even know he was in this. He's just randomly in the fight, all the way over there. Charlie! Charlie, what, are, what are, Charlie, what are you doing over there? Like, honestly, <laughs> this random guy just go like, like I don't know where I'm going. How could, how could I? This is no place for amateurs. How could I kill an enemy that I needed to kill? Do you want me to do a pacifist run on a Valkyrie profile too, McCaggles? Is, is, is that, is this what you want? Cause I didn't know, I didn't know you had such, such. What what is it to say? Activism for for enemy monsters. 
Oh my. Oh, okay. So that's where that leads. A territory of uh, Valinor between two mountains. The village the lead simple lies. Okay. I think I went past this. It may have been right, right around here. Because it was like a desert area. Like legit. That I... No, it wasn't a desert area. It was a water area. The desert area, I just... I got really confused on what to do. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Pacifist run, no fisting. <laughs> yes, pacifist run, Nero everything. was taken to a place just outside Coriander for protection. At least, according to the last remaining records of Depan. So, why this little backwater town? I imagine it was somewhat more prosperous back then. When would that be? The chronicles date back over 500 years. Someone must have taken good care of them. Japan was founded by a sect that broke away from the tribe of Orb Guardians. You know your lore. <laughs> Common knowledge for a loyal subject. I didn't know that. Some princess I am. History fades over time. Well, shall we go? I suppose. <laughs> Chee Dow, don't just stop it. Don't don't talk to McCaggles. He's a player. He's he's gonna he's gonna wreck your heart. That's what he does. On a surface, a plain ordinary village, but in actuality, it's a plain ordinary village. Everyone is self sufficient, so there ain't any, any shops. Okay. Oh, okay. guy. Eh, traveling. Uh, travel invites trouble. Then trouble invites injury. A little cut could cost you your life. But my shop's there to prevent that. We're having a special on Falcons. But to hurry, all oh, these presses—they won't last. They're normally only for regulars, but I'll make you such for free smiles. All right, sure, buddy, sure. Okay. Call the living armor. You might find it in the. Couple of planes. Okay. I did has a different story. Uh, now uh, he was a merchant who knew how to fight. Sure, buddy. Yeah, have a fun. Something to uh, cut off part of a monster. You call them accessories around here. After all, you gotta wear them, don't you? I reckon it ain't the classiest hobby. Uh, they like good luck charms. Put them on and you feel stronger, eh? Buy a tax burn boy and the like. That ain't even the best part. Depending on how well you equip them, they bring out powers, skills, that are slipping inside you. That's a, you're lucky. Here? How about I give you this? Go on, try it out. Ooh! Ooh! Go on now, try those two on. Uh, it's called the match equipment. I reckon matching uh, your weapon or I do the most good. Looking for the match colors whenever you get a hold of some new accessory. Uh, Shadow Ruins mean you make a skill. Don't forget that. Now you're here. Oh, cool, cool, cool. My total view count is 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 two thousand uh, uh two thousand six hundred. That was one of the best years of anime of all time in two thousand seven, kinda. <laughs> we monster hunter now. <laughs> I suppose. I suppose we are. Uh, but yeah, pretty cool. It's nice to have have a two thousand something or other. Maybe we can actually get to, to two thousand sixteen. In the meantime, too, that'd be cool. Uh, let's see here. Whatever. Ah! Okay, so let's just explore this town a little bit more, man. <laughs> I know that was like a whole bunch. But whatever. I know there's some more things here. What's the big idea coming in unannounced? Did anyone tell you, uh, teach you how to knock? Well, at least someone, you know, called me out on that. Who do you think you are? Get your hands off my stuff! <laughs> straight up like new why can't I just take everything that I want I'm a JRPG hero okay I deserve it me dog what can pet dog what are you doing in this village there's not much to see around here just those ruins in the mountains nearby lost man stumbled upon them years ago 
There's something alive in there. So nobody from the village goes near. Okay. That's fair. Yay! Teal's back! Everybody, Teal's back. Oh, I guess. Looking for a room? So I really stay and take a load off. Thank you. I will do. Aw, oh, no in the cutscene. I mean, it's fair, but... I always like it when games kind of give you... Well, JRPGs mostly give you, um... You know Indivisible takes a lot of inspiration for the Valkyrie profile. I know it does. I I know it does, DL. I've mentioned this beforehand, actually. Uh, which, just like, it doesn't make sense to me that FWV is all, like, all kinds of, like... Like, I don't want to, like, play Indivisible. I don't think it's going to be a good game, this and that. Unless, like, he's so against, like, Kickstarter games and things like that. Sure. Yay! We're giving things! Good chicken. You have that bone meal. Yay! Um, right. Thank you. <laughs> That's what I call eating able to do. You can actually, like, feed cats and stuff like that. It's so cool. Ice, ice cold, uh, innervate and burn. <laughs> Do you come because of the rumors of treasure? The adventurers visit very often, but, uh, really disappointed. Look at this place. I, I have looked at this place, sir. Alright. So I guess that was it for that part. So. Yeah, the mountain ruins, that's where I was gonna go. A shine where the orb guardians. The orb guardians uh, reside. Its treasure is heavily guarded on top of the mountain. So let's go ahead and, and go to the mountain area. This was it. Yeah, this this was the, the thing that confused me. So, where's the orb? It might not be here. Are you serious? The tribe that guarded it often moved the orb from place to place for its protection. But, the last of the Guardians have died out. Fine. What exactly are we doing here, then? Silmeria? I'll give it a try. More object reading again? We may find the orb by picking up a trail of psychic energy. Just one problem. I don't see any objects to read. If they placed the orb here for safekeeping, they would have needed a strong dais to hold it. Go find it. <sighs> what? Yes, ma'am. the heck? What's the matter? You mustn't speak to me now. So like every time she comes out like the Valkyrians are able to find her, huh? Oh, it's uh, nothing. <laughs> yeah, second en energy at uh, Chidao. <laughs> you know, winky face. Nudge nudge, say no more. I'll call you when we find the dais. Yeah, this was the area when I when I was younger, um, pretty much six six years ago as far as I'm gonna say. Uh where I was like, I don't know what I'm doing, where do I go? What do I do, Cotton Eye Joe? So let's go ahead and head inward. Go over here. Nothing. Because, like, this is where puzzles, like, got a little bit, like, odd. And where you had to, like, really manipulate enemies type of type of situation. Because, look. Watch. Ah, oh, dang it. No. I did it wrong. Oh, no. I forgot. You can't do, really do that. But you can do this. Just got it. You can do that. So it, it gets really weird. Nah! We're surrounded. Oh, what is that? Ah! 
stupid beaver. Uh, I imagine you want to get rid of the king of all beavers. Oh, no, that is not a beaver. But that's just a regular enemy. Jeez, dude. Hmm. Oh, God. No charging. Oh, no. Just gonna get a little bit closer. Yeah, it's... I'm not doing nearly as much damage as I can do him. Okay, because he wasn't at a, a weak part. That's what it was. Whoa, that is... Something is coming up. Ah, God! I might die here. Oh, jeez. Okay, good. Yeah, there's the leader. Got him! Jeez, dude. This is nuts! I think I actually need to, like, like grind up a bit, because, look, I'm not doing nearly as much damage as I can. Crack, dude. It's a lot of freaking damage and stuff, man. Oh, jeez. That's bad. Oh, come on. Let's do this. Hmm. Alright, there's his armor gone. Yeah, we're doing a lot more damage. Look at that. He just had armor on. That's the problem. Oh, well. He dead. Come on. Why are you not dead? There we go. That took forever. Oh, man. You get me to use a B, uh, a triple jump in this game? That's so dope. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> That, that's what this game was all about. Um, no, it was after Melee, so yeah, it did totally copy it. Well then! This might take some time. Frack, dude. You're not joking, man. Uh, I don't think I can. Yeah, retreat. I have to retreat. Trapped! What?! I was about to say. I want to live a long time. It's about to say. Get off me! Freaking what the hell? Go <laughs> goes the figure that 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 I glitched the game this way. Hmm. So what to do? What to do? I mean, I know what I can do. So it's not really that hard of a thing. I'm actually trying to get that little... Okay, so... So... Okay, so I actually do need to get both of them. Get that over there. It's so weird, like, using enemies as, as blocks, but... I don't know, they just somehow managed to do it pretty well. Did it. There we go. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> Let's try this again. Ah, oh, man. Keep doing that. Alright, just need a... Need this little bit. All right, good, good. Yes, did it. <laughs> All that for that. Okay, but yeah, that largely this game is this game is this part right here. It teaches you how to like do that kind of stuff. It's a bit annoying, but you know whatever. I'll, I'll get through it. I will. Cause I had to learn it the hard way before. Hopefully I'll be able to um, 
it's targeting my enemies proper. Oh. It's here! The orb! <laughs> How would it be that easy, guy? Come on. Amazing. Look at that glow. Hey, isn't anybody else excited about this? I am. That is not the dragon orb. It is a seal stone formed by a geological anomaly. And what's that? A mass of energy. It is a substance without matter, normally impalpable and invisible to human senses. It resonates with my spiritual energy, causing it to radiate visible light. Oh, wow. Photons convert energy absorbed from the roots of the world tree Yggdrasil to light. Yggdrasil, okay. Seal stones are residue formed from the hardened sap that drips from Yggdrasil's roots. You'd know she struggled with that word, too. You mean, like Amber from Yggdrasil? Call it Amber, if you will. A seal stone exerts power over the area it is placed. It suppresses the actions of enemies bound to this location and the surrounding areas. Then, how about if we take it with us for protection? For luck! Seal stones don't just affect enemies. The bearer may also be subject to some change. If you were to carry it, Sir Rufus, then the effects would be felt by all of us. What kind of effects? I'm afraid that's just it. One cannot know until one tries. The tribe that guarded the Dragon Orb had to be very familiar with these seal stones. So, they used that knowledge in building palaces to keep the Dragon Orb safe. Sounds like it wouldn't hurt to take it with us. Seal stones constantly require a base. During the process of transferring from a dais to another dais, the carrier acts as a base. Seal stones cannot be disposed of, nor can they be held on to forever. At some point, their world-sustaining power will crush the holder. Jeez. All right, so I can't handle it. You could have said that from the beginning, you know. Okay. What now? It's your call. Um... Real funny. Thanks a lot, Silmeria. <laughs> just, just left him in the dust. 